Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about our fundamental carbon grab. Kind of a crazy title, but I think as we go through this you'll see what we're after here. I had a big discussion the other day with an engineer, a quite famous engineer, who uses both our carbon and foam technology. And we were talking about the, the carbon and, and what it does, and, and the foam and what it does, and how he felt on his end as an engineer the benefits, the features and the benefits it was given him. And the overall conclusion was it made his life easier and he's, he was able to mix faster and get done quicker. Boy, what a welcome change. I mean, I like selling products to customers, helping them with their problems, but when an engineer compliments me on the technology that I've created, that really means a lot to me because engineers understand it, they get it, they want the room to be easy to work in. They don't want to have to second guess the room. They don't want to have to take their mixes to other rooms to see how they translate. They want to create, process, and output, get it out the door, okay? All in the same room. So he said to me some interesting things. Let's go through a few of those. He said, I have to learn how to mix the low end all over again. And I said, well, why is that? And he says, well, I hear more. I hear more definition. I hear more detail. I hear more fundamental strike. I hear more harmonic tail. I just hear more. So if I hear more, I have to, you know, allow for that in the mix. So I thought that was interesting. More resolution, better attack and decay rates, all things that are important for low frequency management. And he said another interesting thing about the foam technology, because he uses both our carbon and our foam technology. He calls our foam organic, which is, I think, a great term, a uh, term that's used a lot today. And I said, well, why do you say that? And he says, well, it's so natural sounding. He says, I don't do anything right out of the gate after it's recorded. He says, the voice sounds so natural and organic that I don't do anything to it. I just go ahead and drop it right in the mix. Now, that said, down the road, I may add a little processing to get it to sit better in the mix, maybe a little reverb, a little delay, or whatever you know, artifacts that you're gonna to toss into it. But he says right out of the gate, it's, it's just sounds so natural and organic. And I was like, wow, you have made my year, you know? And he said, Something, another thing back to the carbon, he said something really interesting. He said, the carbon grabs the fundamental and just holds it long enough for the harmonic to go into the room. Because so many times the fundamental just overpowers everything in the room. And he said, with the carbon, it grabs the fundamental, holds it just long enough so that the tail or the harmonic can be heard in the room and in the mix. And I thought that was interesting. Kind of grabs the fundamental and holds it, gets so the tail can, can move, and, and grabs the fundamental so the tail can be heard, I guess is a great way to uh, say it. And uh, those, were, those were his words. So I thought those were some interesting comments from a very, very famous and well-respected engineer in the field who uses both our carbon and our foam technology. So I thought you'd all find this interesting. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video, and if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions, and I usually get a chance every couple days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum, and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis, so that'll help you. Thank you.